what is going on guys welcome back to the channel critical overlord here so the expression that you see on the face of bill harder right now was literally my expression once i started getting into this recently released new trailer that we got for it chapter two uh it looked absolutely amazing i thought everything that was showcased didn't spoil too much it didn't reveal too much as as like in terms of anything specific in the movie it shows things in the movie that you can expect but it's like they didn't show too much to the point where now i have no interest in wanting to see it because it, it wasn't an instance where they showed too much in the trailer basically everything in the trailer seemed very fitting um uh, the music in the background was very tense it was that traditional music you typically hear for a trailer that's trying to advertise and signify that this is the end of a series or this is the final chapter in a set of work uh, I really appreciated that aspect of the trailer. The shots that we saw in the trailer were absolutely breathtaking. I think Bill Skarsgård once again looks amazing dressed up as Pennywise. Uh, Jessica Chastain, she looks like she's gonna do a phenomenal job in this role as Beverly Marsh, a grown up Beverly Marsh. I think the entire adult cast is gonna knock me out of the park, but I'm specifically have my eye specifically on Bill Skarsgård and uh, James McAvoy, because James McAvoy he's one of the he's like one of the better actors that we have in the industry right now uh he's come a long way since that narnia film he was in i believe he was uh one of the characters in the lion the witch in the wardrobe he's come a long way since that uh bill skarsgård again he looks like he's knocking it out of the park having a lot of fun playing pennywise and terrorizing the now grown-up adult losers club uh it's going to be very interesting to see how this all unfolds but the trailer just made it just sealed the deal for me i was already excited for the movie but now i'm even more excited because the first trailer the first trailer kind of just made me smile and i was like i yeah i definitely can't wait to see this but this trailer here it kind of just sealed the deal for me. I have to go see this movie on opening night. I have to go see it as soon as it comes out. Uh, no matter what I have to do, I have to be there opening night or the next day after. It's, either way, I have to see it that weekend because this trailer was just breathtaking. Everything looks good. Andreas Muschietti, I believe that's how you pronounce his name. Uh, recent reports come out that he wants to do a remake of The Howling. And if this is any signs, like he's just a phenomenal director. And I think they've done a good job of capturing some stuff from the books the second half of the books when they're adults but i did notice some things in the trailer that i don't think really were in the books that or they kind of just over exaggerated a few things which is of course always necessary when you're telling a movie or when you're trying to recreate a book uh you do tend to over exaggerate a few elements just to make it a little bit more impactful uh this is a good solid trailer for the movie for it chapter two uh the adult losers club looks amazing the little tidbits we saw of the young cast again they looked very they it was just the whole trailer was just like amazing i don't have really too many other words outside of just amazing it didn't show too much it wasn't considering the fact that it was over two minutes i'm surprised that it really didn't it didn't really show too much it showed us it showed one instance where james mcavoy is going to have an interaction with the child and pennywise is present but that's pretty much it uh, I think that's really like the longest spoilery type of scene that we can expect. Uh, we didn't really get to see how certain scenes would play out in this trailer. They didn't really show that much. They just showed nice little clips to get you excited. Uh, I don't expect this move to be showed alongside The Lion King this evening. I have been seeing a lot of people speculating if The Lion King would show this trailer like a part of the previews before the movie starts. I don't think that's going to happen. Uh, the trailer that we got today for It Chapter 2, uh, if you haven't already checked it out, I, gar I guarantee that you will not be disappointed if you were already looking forward to this movie. This trailer that was just released should just seal the deal for you. It's a well-made trailer. Everything looks top-notch. I can't wait for September. Uh, let me know what you guys think about it down in the comment section below. Those are my thoughts on the trailer. Uh, if you've seen the trailer, let me know what you thought about it down in the comment section below. If you haven't already, subscribe and turn on post notifications so you never miss a video. In the description, I have links on my social media accounts, my Facebook, Twitter, and Instagram. You can message me there to so let me know what movies, news, or reviews you would like me to cover in the future. With all that in mind, guys, I will see you in the next video.